Good day, everyone! My name is Spoonoon, and welcome to Henry Stickman Collection! I'm so fucking excited for this. I don't know why, but I fucking love this series, this game. And now they fucking re-uploaded all of them. Even the fucking old ones. And I cannot fucking wait to start them. I had to sneak in a little to, like, see I need to spoil for myself. And it's fucking hilarious. Oh my god. It all starts with breaking the bank. And then we'll continue just like that in the entire series. Let's do this. <laughs> hmm. I love this. Greetings! <laughs> Do we all remember that? Oh, that was so hilarious. Bring him to the bank. I know exactly what's correct and what's wrong. This is correct, the worst is wrong. So I'm gonna do from left to right. <laughs> you see how everything is re-uploaded and looks amazing? I fucking love- I did not expect that. Never dig straight down. <laughs> I actually thought... <laughs> this is all different! I didn't know that! <laughs> Handle with care. Oh my god. I love this. I fucking love this. Are you gonna stick... Stuck in the wall like last time? Oh, just like last time. <laughs> it's emerging technology. I'm sure it will get better. Yeah, it will probably. Laser! Uh oh. That's gonna follow me. Yep, just like last time. <laughs> Open sesame. A wrecking ball. Oh boy. Oh yeah, that is pretty loud. <laughs> Pen fail? Get all BS. <laughs> There's no construction schedule for today. Uh, bios? To unlock a bio, right click to your character when you see them. Oh! Unlock. Oh, I should have right clicked him. So, what's this then? Get all BTB fails. Break into the bank. Okay, so let's try and reclick the officer. I want to see what happens. New bio! I should always re-click them now. That's good to know. I'm gonna try and re-click them all the time. Alright, what is this new bio? What does it say? Uh, Henry Stickman. He is short on cash, so it's time to get some. Not to be confused with Henry Stickman. <laughs> Henry Stickman? Henry Stickman? Oh, interesting. Chad Hansen. Fresh out of college. Guarding a bank sounds awesome. Unfortunately, this job happens to be in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Let's go break in with a disguise. I fucking love this game. I don't know why, but I fucking love it. Eh? How did we lose one? I think we should throw it in the back. Just to Just be safe. Be safe. <laughs> you ever wonder why there's a bank out here? Well, I think it's supposed to be like more of a vault, you know? Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> Why does it say bank then? Oh well, who cares? I forgot to right click the other two, but it's not that important. <laughs> Freeze! Don't move! This is about when he's like, Arr. I don't know why, but I love this game so much. The story begins complete break into the bank. Next. Oh, next. Episode 1. Escaping the prison. <gasps> ah! I'm exploding of joy and happiness. Oh, you. You're free to go. Damn it. <laughs> Not really. But you've got a package. Do I know? Is it Don't a cake? Don't get your hopes up. We've already checked it for anything useful. Haven't we, Dave? What? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> of course I checked it. I mean, if I didn't check it, I'd lose my job, and I don't lose my job. <laughs> <laughs> See you Free to go. Oh, that's amazing. Even on the t Ah, oh, the cake, of course. This has multiple endings now. Oh, it actually looks different. Well, let's drink it right up. Actually, I'm curious about the people first. Uh, we... Rapper Price, he's been on the force for nearly eight years. He joined the police academy right out of high school. 
Dave Pamper, he's new to the force and eager to do a good job. Aw, I'm sorry, man. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Energy drink. That's not gonna go well. <laughs> yep. Is he gonna bend the metal just like. Hmm. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so when it says red, it's already known. Oh, that's amazing. I love this. <laughs> oh, man. And... Heart attack. And... Fall over. <laughs> <laughs> Energy. Side effects include nausea, headaches, rapid heart rate, and impossibilities of stroke and heart attack. Hmm, well that's good to know. Just like before. What did it say about the other ones? Uh, Blake Niffman McGee. Serving multiple life sentences for multiple counts of murder, he gave himself the nickname Knife Man. Okay. Kev Portley. He only became a cop because he knows cops eat donuts and he loves donuts. You won't catch him doing much police work. <laughs> <laughs> Stump Blump. He was beat up a lot as a child because of his name, for obvious reasons. Aw, I'm sorry. Ryan Goldman. Red Mesa Penitentiary's Employee of the Month for the month of June. Very cool. Henry Stickman. Arrested for the attempted burglary at the bank. He now sits in Red Mesa Penitentiary. Sorry for my English. I don't read much. Map. I knew it. Drill? Teleporter. Um... Let's do the window first. I want to see what happens with the window. <laughs> I know what's gonna happen. He's gonna fall. <laughs> Look before you leap. Oh, that's amazing. I love the map. I really love this. This is so efficient. And rocket launcher. Oh, yeah. But I know how this is gonna end as well. Uh. Oh! There we go. Ow. Uh, way too <laughs> way too aim, buddy. <laughs> Indeed. Um, uh, Harold Ronson. He works as the prison's janitor, but he only enjoys doing the maintenance work. Okay, then. Well, now what? Um, so that didn't go. It was planned. Now is the question, what am I going to use now? Teleporter! Hmm. Yep, I, I rem- Fire! Oh, man. I, <laughs> you just can't seem to get the hang of that thing, can you? No, I can't. Uh, what about these two? Jonas Nugan. He's qu been quickly moving up the ranks. He just needs to pass that marksman exam. Captain Roland Canterbury, the man in charge of all office trainer at Red Mesa, known to be very strict. Okay then. Well, can't seem to get the hang of that teleporter, can I? Okay. Now is the question, uh, let's do the phone call or the file? I think in the file. Let's do it extra loud. Cell door. Let's do this. Oh yeah, I gotta get ready. I remember all these games like it was yesterday. There's a timer? Oh shit! Nice, I like that timer. How are you both doing? Ah, oh, that's the same ones. Hey, he's escaping! <laughs> he's escaping! Bye! Uh, now Ooh. what? Grenade belt! <laughs> Yo, check yourself! Yo, check yourself! What the? What the? <laughs> I don't even know what to say about that one. Yep. Exactly. Uh, does it? Sh oh, it does show. Oh yeah, I need to fail hmm? first. I forgot. Bam! <laughs> what was that about? You forgot the real legs of a statue. Hmm. You can defend yourself by tapping the alert. Ah, yes, indeed, I can. Hmm? Well, now not anymore, buddy boo. <laughs> but what's that behind me? You're slow. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to tell you. There's another one around coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Alrighty then. How about the chair? Bye bye. Come on, you can do it. There you go. Oh yeah, left was bad if I remember correctly. Oh. 
Yeah. Damn it, I couldn't get them all fatty? I'm sorry. Jesus. Uh, what about this one? John Fawn, a rookie at the team. This is the first meeting he's ever attended. Carlos Bertel, he works a desk job at the prison. He prefers it over going into the dangerous field. Oh, interesting. STR8 Shooter legally changed his name to that name. He spits out hot fire and raps mad lyrics respect. Okay, interesting. John Critz just got back from breaking up a fight between two inmates. Didn't go as well. <laughs> so well. John... <laughs> Nah! <laughs> he joined the police force for action, but they've struck him behind a desk. Uh, John Bali failed out of fireman's training three times. He is technically not allowed to use his weapon outside of the shooting range. Captain Jeffrey Gustard, 30 years ago, a janitor threw out his, out his lunge. He's held a grudge against janitors ever since. Okay, Jesus Christ. I really want to see if I can get all of them, but I'm just going to get on with it. I know your guys' time is valuable as well. Hmm, now what? Hmm. A box. Rope, parachute, plungers, or jetpack. I know all of these. So let's do the parachute first. Yep. The most amazing thing is... He's gonna survive the fall, just to die from the bowling ball. I think that was just a regular backpack. See what happens when you assume? Yeah, I do assume. Now the rope! Uh, ah. Yep. I also survived this one, but... <laughs> this seems awfully familiar. <laughs> Jetpack! <laughs> oh look, the building is different. That's nice. And... Uh, ow. Oh look, you're back. Oh look, you're back. Takes many hours of jetpack training before you're able to do operate one. Yes indeed, so let's use the plungers. Yay! Sneaky escapist! Oh! Totals! Escaping the prison. Endings 1 out of 3, unique fails 11 out of 18. Ah, oh, okay, I see. I see now. So now I need to get the... No, not the chair one. Uh, where's my first one? There it is. Now, I need to call somebody. How about a... Lawyer. September 9th, 12.53 p.m. District Court. Courtroom number 4. <laughs> Witness, please continue your testimony. Okay. I was riding alongside my partner and the armored man, but suddenly he spotted a bag on the side of the road. We got out and eventually decided to throw the bag in with the others. We didn't know there was someone hiding in there. Objection! So, the defendant crawled into that bag in order to break into the bank. Is that correct? Is it not obvious? Is it really that obvious? I have proof that the defendant didn't hide himself in that bag. Well then, what are you waiting for? Present this evidence already. And I know exactly what evidence it is, but I'm just gonna pick a random one before. Attorney's badge. Uh, sure, fucking, who cares? It's my all- It's my all important badge. It shows that I am a defense attorney. Yeah, but which one would be the most bullshit? I guess security footage. Let's do this. Take that! Take that! What is that? What is this? It's evidence. It's evidence. And how exactly does this prove anything? Hmm. It doesn't. Well, I- <laughs> I was just kidding. Let me try- this is no time for jokes. I see no reason to further prolong this trial. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, guilty. What kind of third-rate lawyer did you hire? Some that did what I wanted to do. Let's use the correct one. Take that! Is, is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? Huh? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. 
But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are you, you saying? saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stuffed in there. By this very witness! <laughs> <laughs> As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious! <laughs> this is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There were millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, this, this, this can't be happening to me! <laughs> I love this game so much, I don't know why. Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, NOT GUILTY! Excellent, well done, lawyer. Oh! Oh god, I wasn't fast enough. Lawyer up! Grand lawyer! I think I need to wait. Totals! Escaping the prison. Endings 2 out of 3. Unique fails 12 out of 18. Okay. Bios! Okay, what do we have new here? Wait, what? Oh, it's already ready? Fascinating. <clears throat> Felix White, the city's most prominent defense attorney. He works hard to ensure innocent people are not put away. Herbert Brown, one of the city judges. It's very difficult to tell him apart from other judges in the city. Okay. <clears throat> Valamir Van Brown, nemesis to Mr. White. He's pretty cocky in his ability to put criminals away. This often becomes his downfall. Haha. <laughs> Witness Winston Davis. He's been deposed due to his involvement in the bank's breaking. Either way, he won't be going back to his old job anytime soon. Ah. Chuck Semmets, he works at Sandwich City and enjoys his free sandwich for every <laughs> every day. Juno Grumtert, he re he's received jury duty 27 times this year. This can make even the most cheery man c cynical. Interesting. So there's another ending? Where? Excuse me? What? There's another ending? Like what? There's this. I don't see one. 4 out of 4, 2 out of 2, 2 out of 2, 3 out of 3, just 2... Where is it then? Excuse me? Pardon me? What about this one? Ah, yes, of course. I don't see one. Um... I'm an idiot, the drill. Sorry, I was an idiot. Everyone's like, use the drill! I'm like, I'm sorry! F first I thought I used the drill, but I'm like, wait, no, I didn't. A passenger! A bass there, you'll walk through walls. Just move the blue slider to the right and you'll become a scoopy. That means the see through for all the undertaken folks. As you want, not only that, but the more optic you get, the easier it will be for you to pass through solid objects. Gadget Gabe 2009. Approved. By Gadget Gabe. Bye. Whee! Wait. Oh, I should have right clicked. <laughs> Crust mental out of core. <laughs> You'd think something like that would come up in the beta testing. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Gary Gray constantly put on evidence to his least favorite job. Oh, I'm sorry, man. Okay, so. Oh, yes, I'm an idiot. Now the crowbar! Dr. Freeman? <laughs> Ow. Whoa. Uh. Run! Uh. Nee! <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> Don't worry, I hear prison enders are great. No, they're not. Left. There we go. Oh, next time I should have waited. I'm gonna wait. What happens if I don't do anything? I'm gonna freaking die. Wait, who's that? There we go. Ow. It's always a good idea to watch where you're going, especially if you're running away from the cops. Exactly. Oh, man. And now I shall go left and trip. Sorry for the spoilers. Hi, yo! Law Ball reference! Law Law Ball reference! I'm sorry. Let's do this. 
wall climb like a badass. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. There we go. I love this game. This game is amazing. Oh my god. Total is escaping the prison endings. 3 out of 3, 16 out of 18. Ah yes, now I need to get the other endings. I need to... Oh yeah, I need to fail here. I need to dot like an idiot. Oh, I already got this one? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm dead. Come on, you were so close. Nah, I wasn't. Okay, who's new? <clears throat> Bust Slim. Bert Slim, I'm sorry. He's been on the force for six years now, and yet there are still days that surprise him. And Tom Hardley, he takes his job very seriously, never seems to take those sunglasses off. <laughs> Captain Ed Roberts, the chief of police here at Red Mesa. He runs a tight ship and expects the best from all his cadets. Timothy Pug, fairly new to the force, does not handle pressure well. <laughs> yeah, we noticed. Michael Benz joined the force at the same time as his best friend. He is the clean Chevron one. Okay. Sean Seen, this is the first day back. This is his first day back from a nice vacation. You ruined it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Matthew Flexer, he joined the force at the same time as his best friend. He has a goatee. Okay then. And that is everything, right? Or is there one more left? Oh, I'm sorry. Oopsies. My bad. Oh. Ping! <laughs> oh, yeah. I forget. Oh, yeah. Skip! Sorry. Uh, and which one was that? Do I just die? Do I just fail? Dead. <laughs> Try dodging the bullets, noob. Prisoner, get all the- Oh, did I get all of them? <gasps> I did. You know what that means? Let's get on with it. Uh, menu. Do I get it like this? Stealing the diamonds. Oh, listen to it. Very nice, I love this. Oh, very cool. As the mayor, I hereby declare the Tunisian archaeological exhibit open. Open. Yes, thank you. Yes. yes, thank you, thank you very much. Pew, 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 first. <laughs> what the hell? Ah, yes. Oh, I cannot. Mm, I remember this so well. I remember this so freaking well. I don't know how. <laughs> Henry Sigmund. Life has been rough after breaking out of prison. Time to make some quick cash by stealing the two Asian diamonds. Ah, interesting. Mayor Fredrickson. The underdog winner of last year's election. is popular among the citizens because of his love for the arts. Ah, I see you. Let's do it loud and proud. First, I'm going to do nothing. Actually, I'm going to try and do it first, right? And then I'll screw up. There we go. Boom. Oh, yeah. Boop. 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 Whoa. Whoa. Uh, we got a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that. We're preparing to engage over. <laughs> I love this. There we go. Good thing the time is better this time. And after that, they just up and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah, that's when I decided I should probably get a different job. I figured night garden is much less dangerous than driving a... Crap. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> oh god! 
damn it. I was busy clicking them. <laughs> I can see all those hours of pl playing video games. I really sharpened your food reflex. I'm sorry. Screw you. I'm gonna read all of them at the end, by the way. Uh, retry. Rock! Get out of here! Oh, down, down. oh, he says officer down. I thought he was like, oopsie down, repeat, oopsie down. <laughs> uh. And we're good. The poor diamond being cut like that. Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. You leave me no choice, sir. You you leave me no choice as well. Bye bye. How didn't the diamond sink, by the way? Shouldn't the diamond sink? Just a thought. Intruder on a scooter. <laughs> Intruder on a scooter. Nice. I love this game so much. I can say that a thousand times. Oh man. Oh, interesting. Very interesting. I see. I see now. So, busting was that the only approach? Okay. Now, I'm gonna decide to do a sneak in, and then we'll decide to screw around with the fails. <laughs> okay. Uh, which one was correct again? I know this one is correct. Now, oh, let's do it. Creeper! Aw, oh, man. <laughs> yeah, so apparently there's something in that cake, and uh, he used the Jesus. Cake, and then I got fired. Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, point. please shut up. Oh, I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation, you know. Since I mean, we're partners, so I just wanted to get, get to know each other a little bit, you know. I just kind of wanted to have a conversation. <laughs> just you know, just, just lighten things up. I mean, do you feel a draft? In a museum, I mean, really? Do you feel a draft at all? Hey. Hey! <laughs> this conversation is gonna be that interesting. Oh, I thought it was interesting. Uh, play. Uh, I gotta warn some. <laughs> oh, I already know this one. Okay. Uh, oh yes, I remember. Bye bye. Don't mind the knock of a cop there. <laughs> oh. There we go. Hmm. Alien, good ball. You know what? I'm gonna do all the fails now. Face huggers! No, face huggers are uh, head crabs. Hello, head crabs. How's it going? Man, I hate it when that happens. Yeah, me too, man. Me too. Alien attack! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they don't like take kindly to orders. No, they don't. No, they don't. Oh, no. This is gonna hurt my ears. Prepare for your ears being hurt. Okay then. <laughs> nice, I like that. Okay, let's get let's do it serious. He doesn't count. <laughs> my diamond! Yay! I lost my super power! Oh no! <laughs> oh god! Oh no! Somewhere in the southwest center of chaos containment. Uh, sir? Y you might want to come look at this. I'm getting chaos readings at 10.6. It's coming from the museum. It's over nine? God. It's over nine? Yeah. <laughs> I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. Just hit one of those buttons to deal with this pressing situation. Who's watching TV? Get back to work. <laughs> Sorry, Chief. I'm going back to work. Uh, okay, I'm going to screw around with these ones first. I think the correct one was this one. So let's nuke the goddamn place. Nuke him.
my god! Destroyed. Jesus, this time the museum is completely gone. <laughs> well, don't feel bad too bad. <laughs> don't feel too bad. He probably came for the nuke. 25 kills he needed to get that. I'm sorry, my English is terrible. <laughs> I'm too excited for this game. I'm flipping out. <clears throat> this is gonna go bad. Yep. <clears throat> Sorry, I was in the bathroom. What did I miss? Uh, wait, where is everyone? I don't know. Don't miss. Don't question it. I'm a firing my laser. <laughs> I couldn't resist, me neither. Boop. It's so loud! This is amazing. I love this game so much. So much nostalgia coming up. I'm gonna cry! By the way, Diamond. Yeah! Back! Just plain epic! <laughs> uh, well done. I love this. Endings, 2 out of 3. Unique fails. <clears throat> 8 out of 40. Oh, man. That was amazing. So, there was one left. Ah, oh, yes. Upstairs. Um, I think it was teleporter. And boink. Where are we? Ow. <laughs> what the hell? That was different. Oh, no. I didn't click him. Uh, Falcon Punch. Falcon Punch. There we go. <laughs> Only one man is capable of doing that punch. Yeah, I agree. Come on, do it. Take it. Get him. <laughs> what happened? I lost track of you. <laughs> In the past game, it's like, whoop, da, da, ah! he falls over and trips. Jangleizer. Oh. I don't know how that makes sense. Whoa, what are the odds of that? I agree. Oh, look, a penny. Oh, look, a penny. Hmm. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> uh, do you really think that was going to work? Maybe. <laughs> the other ones worked. Why shouldn't that one work? One more rifle. One more rifle? It was portal gun. Oh, well. Where's the difference? Yep. <laughs> I read this the last time, so if you guys want me to read it this time, you gotta go back to the other one. Go ahead, read it yourself. Okay, you're good. Uh, I'm not gonna bother. I'm not gonna bother about it today. Wee. Small tip: it took like five minutes for me to read because I'm a slow reader. I'm a bad reader as well. Let's go to. I'm dead. You get cut, why you no bleed? Hammer! Poof! <laughs> <laughs> you guys are not talking? Okay. <sighs> SpongeBob SquarePants, are you serious? Well, let's eat some cheese. Look at that SpongeBob SquarePants reference. That was delicious cheese. <laughs> what? 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 Seriously? Yes. Uh, cannon. Ow. <laughs> you almost saved it. Almost. Yep, almost. Come on, plank. There we go. And after that, they just stopped and arrested him. Whoa. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> I remember this one. What? 
<laughs> I told you, man. I told you about stairs. <laughs> Rifle. Yep, you're a great shot. Man, those first person shooters make it look so easy. Yeah, and they're stick figures. It's really fucking impossible to hit a stick figure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry you made it that far with that heavy diamond. I agree. I agree. <laughs> that must hurt. To be honest, I think that would kill you. Unseen burglar. Nice. Rank, you be. <laughs> Yay. He must have sold a diamond. I got all three endings, now to get all the fails. Let's read all the bios first. <clears throat> Jeff Stickley, he enjoys his rooftop posts. It gives him a chance to admire the stars. He considers himself a, an amateur astronomy. Aw, how cute. Ted McAdamson, he quite, he quit working as an armored truck driver after a certain incident. Yeah, I remember. Jacob Rose, the museum's newest hire. He is still in training, so he's not allowed to work unsupervised quite yet. This one, Cliff Knox. He picked up some smoking so he could take more breaks. Okay. Zash Knutz takes his job seriously. Some of his co-workers get annoyed with his constant use of the walkie-talkie. <laughs> oh, man. Hemberg Schult. I think that's German. Schult. Works with the museum on a foreign exchange program. Nobody knows exactly which country he's from. Schult. German. I think. Germany. Billy Clout, oh, he's uh, looking uh, for excuses to use his nightstick. He loves to show off his skills to his co-workers. <laughs> Sam Turner, they love the guardian aspect of the security guard work. Action dealing with burglars, not so much. Richard Watkins, he's a hard-working fellow who's, who always tries to do his best. He loves chocolate. Robert Price, he worked this workplace suffered a huge embarrassment. He's determined to work extra hard now. My words is terrible. It's hard to work odd hours at m museum. Your sleep hours get all messed up. He's doing his best. Johnny Panzer Panzer has <laughs> risen quickly through the ranks, and it's no surprise his skills are well above average. Okay, Jack Sean, the only helicopter pilot on the force who can fly to the city and back in two under two hours. Interesting. Samuel Mundy, Mundy, interesting. He's not a crazed assassin, but he doesn't work for the police department either. Looks like he was hired for a job. Yep, he was. Samuel James Lancelot frequently eats at those medieval restaurants, claims his family used to be normals way back then. <laughs> Dave Panpa, Panpa, he was fired from his previous job for negligence. He bounced back quickly, though he found a new job as a security guard. Okay, cool. Oh god, Kurt, Kurt Dietrich, Dietrich, sounds German to me. This guy has been going to work, not to mention they paid, paired him with some annoying newbie. Gah! Joseph Joe, he may not look it, but he's a scrappy guy. He's not itching for a fight, but he won't back down if challenged. Timothy Lewis goes by Tim. His work shift usually involves running a nightly patrol. Alexander Crab, he is scared of heights and birds. Oh no. <laughs> Tony Franz, he's secretly in the Mafia. He got placed here so that, that he could launder money. Oh, interesting. Clyde Jenkins, a standard-level employee at the Center of Chaos Containment, CCC protocol, requires you to run action by a superior officer. Corporal Bill Bullitt, the person in charge at the Center of Chaos Containment Central Branch, he is pretty lax and trusts his agents to do their jobs well. Okay. Oh my god, that was a lot to read. I'm not going to do that again. <laughs> Let's get all the fails, shall we? <clears throat> and away we go. Uh, jump a little bit. Jump a little I'm not sure. I got thirsty from all that reading. <clears throat> I don't get that reference. Sweet flip, bro. Jump a hoppers. I'm sorry. Anti-gravity cap.
Yep. Um. You gonna do? <laughs> You're lucky. I've always wanted to get to space. <laughs> to go to space. I'm sorry. I'm twisting my own words. Uh, liquid fighter, Kater. I don't fucking know. Liquid Brigade! Turn yourself into a liquid and bend your molecules around or through any object. 10 out of 10. It's fantastically easy to use. Gadget game. Okay then. And dead. What do you think was going to happen? I don't know. Something magical. Shrink ray. Whee! And watch out. What sound was that? Jesus. Man, worms are so much more vicious up close. They are. <laughs> um Oh yeah, the other two weapons. <clears throat> bomb! Ow. Why wouldn't they keep a live bombs in the museum? I don't know, man. Gun! Quick, pretend you were joking. Good one, right, guys? <laughs> Good one, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> sorry, I picked the wrong one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm embarrassed a little, but it's okay. Don't tell the others. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> hmm. Ah, oh. oh, yeah, that one. Hmm, must be a light sleeper. Yeah, just a little. Um. Yeah, I got that one. And... Uh, I got all these ones. Now about this one. Oh yeah, I remember. Yowchies. Wow, you're off to a great start. Yeah, I agree. Uh, kick. <laughs> Ledger, find all SCB uh, the bios. Nice. Well, you got one of the guards, I guess. Uh, and uh, jump. Ow. <laughs> Let's read about them. Really quickly. <clears throat> Conrad Connors. He got the job as a security guard, becomes his friend, hooked him up. They turned into work their shifts together. <clears throat> Billy Barnes. Usually manages to work the same shift as his friend. Okie dokie. Now, shall we? And we got that one. Now let's do this one. Dead. Good thing the janitors got just got buffing the floors. Could you imagine all the germs you'd be rolling in right now? They hadn't? I know, right? Gosh. Lance! Whoa. Ow. <laughs> Jossing, it's harder than it looks. Yeah, it's, it's very hard. Flail! Ew. Hello. <laughs> stop hanging around and do something. Hehe, <laughs> get it? Okay, I'll stop. Yeah, you better. Oh, sorry. Uh, he, uh, boop! Bonk. Whee! I surrender! I'm sorry! I surrender! I'm sorry! Put your hands up, boy! Don't do the muscle. <laughs> Put your hands up, boy! Come on, you don't have to just stand around. Time to stand around. Basket! Whee! Ah, Chuck, I bet you wished you paid more attention to physics last night, huh? Yeah, I bet I do. Uh, yes. I love this music. <laughs> Wait. Shit. Ah, oh, I already got that one. Didn't really think that one through, did ya? Uh, no. Uh, which one was the other one? I guess just being sniped. Oh no, I already got shot. I need to get sniped. Hello. Now I got three stars. Hi! What is that red light? Wave goodbye to your head, Waker. Aww. They removed his voice. No. Oh, oh well. It's fine. Jesus. <laughs> it used to be the sniper reference. Oh, come on, man. From TF2. That's yeah, fine. Uh, yeah, we go. Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. You leave me no choice, sir. Dude, do something. Nah. Sir, place your hand. Yep. <laughs> I don't think you're gonna get very far with that. Yeah, I. Sir, I think place so. Place your hands where I can see them. Eh? Bribery is a federal offense, sir. Ah, uh, that's what he was doing. 
I was always wondering what that was. Strange, that usually works. I thought so as well. And that's all the map of the diamond. Ah, we're halfway through. Breaking the bank, escaping the prison, stealing the diamond, and next we will do infiltrating the airship. Remember this one, guys? I do. We just did it some time ago. And then we know what comes in the next one. So, this has been Henry Sigman, the incomplete edition, but don't worry, we're not gonna stop here. We're gonna do it infiltrating the airship and fleeing the complex in the next episode. Then we'll see what the third one will be. I'm curious. So, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys all enjoyed Henry Sigman as much as I did. And as always, I'll see you next video. Bon joy and good talk. Thank you.